actually if I knew that I will talk with you I would not come here I came here asking for help for the, from them to acknowledge me as a that's father of my daughter you don't, that's, I don't that's want to listen to any things if you want to talk talk to them not to me we need to settle things between I don't care about you I will not settle anything about you you don't mean anything to me what I need is my daughter Mr. Bachar, okay. you can call me Bash. Mr. Bash, I understand that you have a child yeah, with a Filipino, two years. two years old. She's a girl. But currently, uh, you are not recognized legally as yeah. the father of yes. your of your, her birth of your certificate. Daughter. Okay, this is uh, what I'm here for to ask help to to be able to mention as her father in her birth certificate. Okay, and have visitation right. Okay, so when was the last time that you spoke with uh, Anne? Regarding this one, we messaged each other two days ago. Okay, I but, already saw my daughter maybe three days but ago. But are you still in a relationship with each other? No, 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 we are not in a relationship. So you go back here in the Philippines uh, every once in a while to visit your Yeah, this daughter. is my second time. Okay, how long are you staying here? I'm gonna stay maybe one month. You have tried to reach out with Anne for yeah, this? Yeah, I already uh, saw my daughter two times. Okay. Uh, she allowed me to suit. You open up the topic again of, of you being the. All the time I'm opening the topic. All the time. This what is my only say? concern. What does she say? She, she don't want you. Okay. But you support your daughter? Of course. Okay. Anne, good afternoon. Good ah, afternoon po. Uh, Miss Anne, yes. uh, si Bash nandito sa studio natin, ano? Attorney, actually, he's always been the father for, for, for my daughter. And mm-hmm. I never hide my daughter to him unless he's doing something that is unacceptable. By example, this time, he came back to the Philippines and then last, I, if I'm not mistaken, Thursday. And then he told me two days before that. And then I told him, you are most welcome. And you can come here and you can see your daughter. I told him like this. And then I accepted him here. Then we even went outside. I, I accompanied him and my daughter to roam around my daughter. And then after that, what happened? We went to SM Pampanga. And then after that, I'm trying to put my daughter asleep. And then my daughter doesn't want because he's around. Then he said, if I if he can take out my daughter for a ride like this, I said okay. And then that time we have actually our house is back side of the front uh, of the old house. So technically we have pathway. And then uh, one of the tricycle of my uncle is uh, like uh, he cannot pass by because of the tricycle. And then uh, what he did, he shouted on my uncle. He's saying that. Next time, don't let anybody pass and so and so like this. I have messaged him that please, if next time, if you have problem with my family, if you don't like something, if you don't, if you hate something, don't, if you are angry, talk to me. So I will talk to my family and I will, I am the one who will tell them what's the problem. The issue here is what's keeping you from uh, having Sir Bash as the legal, uh, legal fa- father of uh, your daughter? Okay. Okay, attorney. Uh, first and foremost, when I found out that I am pregnant, he is asking me to abort the baby. Okay? True. I have, I have my reasons why I ask for abortion immediately. I'm not going to talk about it now, but mostly it's about not trusting any word that she's saying. Okay. That's why I first uh, reaction was abortion. When she said no, I went along with it. I supported uh, her from the time she conceived my baby till now. And I will always support my girl. I love her uh, more than my life. Actually, actually, sir, uh, sorry, we've been together for a long time, very long time, okay? Then he's telling me a lot of stories that he had a wife before and he got divorced. And then the wife got multiple pregnant, but he is asking for abortion. Not only from me, but from the people or, or the previous relationship that he had. He uh, asked for abortion. So in his mentality, he don't want a child. If I don't want a child, what I'm doing here? I try all yeah, my that's, ways that's to, to get thing. to see my daughter. First, uh, sorry, yeah, anyway, this is all doesn't matter. What matter? Is she my daughter? And mm. if yes, I want what to be recognized to be. as her father. Legally, they are asking so she can. Is preventing yeah. me all, all your reason is irre- irrelevant about uh, that fact that I am her father or not. I got pregnant in UAE way back then, and then I came back to Philippines to deliver because I cannot deliver them because we are not married. I landed to Davao because I had uh, I I didn't have vaccine, and that's the only port that is available because it's during pandemic. Then when I landed there, the first thing I found out that he had a girl the same day I left UAE. So that time, I 
I I know that it's not good that I took it. I got hurt because but you cannot you cannot avoid being hurt, especially when you are pregnant. I that time I cried and I I had to go to emergency room. The uh, the OWA staff bring me to brought me to uh, public hospitals because I am not sure if they are not sure if I am positive or negative to the to the COVID. Then after that, they my mother called him. What's happening? And then he called me. What he said? I wish you die. I wish you die. I wish you die. While her daughter, his daughter, is inside my stomach. That time, I was six months pregnant, and he uh, knew. In all this, would you say that Bash doesn't love or nor care for your daughter? When the child is still not outside of this world, I may say that he doesn't. Because I asked him multiple times that don't smoke around me because your daughter may take it because it's secondhand smoke. But he never listened to me. This is bullshit. What What is the main reason you think that's keeping you from having Bash uh, this acknowledge is as the father? This is another reason for me, sir. Before I, I, when he told me that I, uh, I want, he wants an abortion, I told him, no, I will raise this if you don't want it. And he said, no, if you will keep having the baby, I will take it from you. He said like this, I will take it from you. If you don't want to stay with me, just go and I will keep the baby. I will not give you my daughter. Okay. This is what he told me clearly. Okay. And so your, your concern here is that if, if, the, if your daughter uh, becomes acknowledged as the daughter of uh, Bash, you fear that Bash will take the, your daughter from you? Am I correct? Yes. One, one of the main reasons. I was thinking of that. It may be one of the main reasons why you are hesitant to have Bash acknowledged as the father. But I think all in all, your daughter will benefit. It will be for the best welfare of your daughter if uh, Bash will be acknowledged as the father legally at the very uh... least. At the very least, your daughter could enforce her uh, support on her father, Bash, and maybe Bash could enjoy some form of uh, visitation rights, which would be better or which, which would be best for the development of the child. Am I correct? Actually, sir, I never stopped. I, last time, September, he was here. I let him. I even let him stay here for the last week. That For the last week, he stayed here in her house. I let him. I let him. I never stopped him seeing his daughter. And second, second of all, he always threatened me, sir. I have proof that 2022, he sent me a message, I will kill you. I will send someone to kill you. You will just be surprised. Your head will only cost 50,000 pesos. This is what he feared. This is bull****. Again. I have proof, sir. I have proof. You cannot say that this is bullshit. I have proof. I'm I'm going to not let you talk about lies anymore. I heard enough of lies. So All of this doesn't want, doesn't really matter about the fact that I am her father and I have the right to be his recognized as her father. All your stories doesn't I don't care about your stories and doesn't matter to me anymore. Your manipulation lies I cannot hear it anymore. All what I want my daughter to be named after me and I have visitation right for her. You, I allowed you to visit her, but uh, it's you not it's not up to you to allow me. This is my right. It's not up to you to allow me. It's not you allow me. Maybe Miss Anne, and someday you don't allow me. This is my right. Uh, maybe Miss Anne, we could come to a common terms wherein it would be acceptable for both of you so that uh, Mr. Bash could have his way with being registered, acknowledged as the father of your daughter. Is uh, there is there a possibility uh, of that happening? I told him when he he mentioned to your staff before that uh, he proposed to me that's true that's true and i will not deny it but uh, and and but, uh, that's uh yes. that's irrelevant for this one we're just talking <laughs> no, about sir, uh, the, your daughter when, when i told him when i told him i'm ready to to be cool for or to fix everything actually i have messages to him let's not fight let's not fight let's not fight at least when you are here but it cannot be happened sir i don't want my daughter that every time that we are together my daughter will see that he is angry, he is shouting, he is cursing me. We are fighting in front of my daughter. My daughter now is two years old. She understands things already. I don't want her that she is seeing us fighting all the time. I don't want her to, to witness that. Miss, Miss Anne, I we're not talking about your relationship with Bash. We're exactly. just talking about the co-parenting arrangement that would be the best for your daughter, I think. I understand, sir. But what I am saying, all I'm asking from him first, 
he should learn how to respect me when I am around of his daughter, sorry. And second of all, he should respect people around when he is around people. Because clearly, if he is mad with something, even with the daughter, he doesn't care. He doesn't care. He will shout, he will curse, he will he will fight. He so so care. what do you want to happen or what do you want a bash to do so that you may be satisfied that he has learned his lesson or he has learned to to respect you? Answer, I, I have asked him to to check for his anger management problem, really. This is what I'm asking from him. He should learn how to manage his anger, especially in front of my daughter. If he takes anger management classes, you would be willing to have him acknowledged as the father of your daughter? For the acknowledgement, sir, that, that's not in my... I couldn't I couldn't say yes right now, sir. I couldn't say right now until I see it. I Until I prove that This is, that this is not your, your right, dear. This is not your right. You are, de- you are taking decisions yes. that is not yours. This is also my daughter's decision. I'm asking you, why now? When I give birth, why you didn't go home? What? Why you didn't I didn't go, go home was because you didn't tell me that I need to be here so for you to you. name me as a father. I told you. you told me I after told this, you. after you get born and no, you went I to the UAE. You. No, I told Again, you. I will not go on and on with your lies and manipulations. I am I actually. I, I if I will, if I knew that I will talk with you, I would not come here. I came here asking for help for the, from them to acknowledge me as a father of my daughter i don't want to listen to any things if you want to talk talk to them not to me that's the thing your 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 okay your lies and and manipulation will never end we we need to settle things between i don't care about you i will not settle anything about you you don't mean anything to me okay what uh, i need is my daughter okay what i are you here visit we're trying to find common ground for the both of you we're trying to fix how to find common ground if she's keep lying miss Anne, i think personally your request for him to take anger management is it for you to continue having a relationship with him no or? sir no sir but i last time for example he choked me in front of my daughter just imagine my daughter will grow this. into this kind of situation that my daughter will lead that it's okay it's okay that I'm, my mother is being hurt my mother is in the future if she will have husband she will say Oh, it's okay. Hurt me. It's okay. I don't mind it. Uh, Miss Anne, if you are being physically hurt by Bash, as you claim, you could always file a case against him so that... Uh, I filed... I, I called the police in UAE, sir. I filed a case in UAE. That doesn't mean that when he is in UAE, he will not be behavioral... You know, uh, because usually he is anger. Last time we were in the mall, the salesman is offering him a smartphone. Usually, hi sir, hi mom. Uh, Miss Anne, you're please. saying at the end of the day, if he takes a anger management class and he, you see signs of development in him, you would be willing to have to let him be acknowledged as the father of your daughter. From my side, sir, I couldn't say yes right now until I prove so. Until I prove so that I'm seeing a change with him, I cannot say anything right now. I cannot decide. I cannot decide. It's not your decision to take. Actually, this is my daughter's decision and my decisions. Actually, under the law, you could execute a uh, an affidavit acknowledging paternity. However, to so so that the proceedings do not become uh, adversarial, it is always best to get the consent of the the mother. Because they could object there too if they do not consent with your uh, with the instrument that you are claiming to be the father of the of the child. Okay, you already have been so, told that. Uh, that is why I am trying my best, really, so that uh, so that the two of you could come to terms. We will never come to terms. We'll if that is what you think, sir, uh, this negotiation will already fail. Uh, that is why I've been trying to uh, mm. have you talk. Uh, let's. I'm trying to find common grounds. So, uh, but, are, are you but saying? You could, are you saying that if she say no? that I don't have the right to... You could, but uh, it would take longer because they could contest it. They could contest your affidavit. That is why I am trying my best here uh, to have you come to terms, okay? Uh, but as to, the, the, as to the documents, we could help you with that. You could submit, but definitely they, would, they could and they would object. That's what I think. Uh, that's why prior to us filing the documents, I think it's better if we could iron it out as early as now so that the parties uh, will jointly file. Hmm. Or we'll, jo- we'll jointly agree that you are indeed the father and that the uh, records will reflect that you are indeed the father of your daughter. Okay? So, but I think in this case, well, we can't rush Anne right now 
So maybe as help to you, we could uh, help you draft the documents and file it. But of course, it is subject to their objections. Okay. Uh, okay. We, w- we would file that with the local civil registry where your daughter was born or where where her birth certificate is currently registered. I think it's in Kalumpit. Kalumpit. Uh, yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay. So, but of course, their side will be uh, heard in all this before it will be approved. I'm not sure if I understood this already. So, the fact that she will approve or not approve will change my daughter's DNA? Will alternate my daughter DNA? Well, we might be required. There might be an no, instance. No, no. You, you are no, not no. getting... I get your point. On the scientific standpoint, you, you are the father. So yeah, I am father you, no matter what she, yes, she thinks. Yes, but we are about. talking about the legal standpoint. As it is, sir, you have no relation to your daughter, legally speaking, because uh, you do not appear in the birth certificate of the child. So that's what I am discussing here. Mm. Okay. So that's what we want to remedy. So your options here are for you to file your uh, affidavit of uh, paternity acknowledging paternity, uh, but of course, because there is an opposition, it might take a while and it might not be approved, legally speaking, okay? Mm. Okay, so that is why maybe while we are doing this, maybe you could also try to talk to them, ask uh, Anne what, you, what she wants to happen here. I maybe take the first steps with the uh, anger management class, just so, just so. It's all lies again. Okay. That's in what a- I fed up with her. In any okay. case, uh, that's I just uh, want to prove to my daughter in the future that I asked for her so many times. And let uh, my daughter find me in the future. Okay. In any case, sir, uh, that's the legal recourse you have. And we are willing to help you in this one. Thank you one. so much. I appreciate it. Okay. I appreciate uh, but of course, as I've said, as a matter of caveat, it might be objected to. Maybe our staff will talk to you about the Thank logistics you so and when, when we'll do it, when we'll file. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay. Sir, can I have a question? If ever that he will threat or say something threat again with me, can I file a case against him in immigration? Because still, it's done. Still, I have the proof that he threat me, that he will kill me and pay someone to kill me. That's, Is it possible for me to file a case against him? That's a different issue, but assuming it's true and you have the evidence to back it up, you have all the right to file. Ma'am, ang gagawin niyo na lang po, pag-uusapin na lang po namin kayo, ma'am, sa kabilang studio, ni Bash. Okay, ma'am? Okay. Pero okay. kailangan, ma'am, ang pinakapunto lang dito, ma'am, is kung ano po yung makakabuti para sa bata. Okay. Ang, ang nilapit lang naman po dito ni sir is, of course, yung uh, custody or yung visitation rights, uh, yung mapangalan sa kanya yung bata, yun po yung yung nilapit din ni sir. Nakaalalay naman po kami, pag-usapan niyo po ng maayos. Baka, baka naman, oo. Sabihin mo lang kung anong gusto mo, baka naman kayang i-comply ni Bash. Sige po, Ako. thank you po. Sige po. Alright. Maraming salamat po.